Hey BuzzNet, it's Kelty, and oh my gosh, I can't believe this is really happening. I'm gonna let you inside my closet today. It's very tall. I got it at Ikea and I built it myself and it holds all of my things in this one little square area. So let's take a peek. Ta-da! So I'm a very organized person. So up here I have all my shirts and then all my pants and then shoes, but I thought I would show you a few of my very favorite pieces. This is my Star Wars tank top. Um, do you remember when I wrote that blog about like how the media makes us like feel like we need things? So I was definitely in a store and saw this tank top and it looked really good in the mannequin. I was like, I have to have that Star Wars tank top. I'm gonna be honest with you, I've never seen Star Wars. I don't know why I bought this, so, and I've only worn it once. Here's that. I probably have, um, I don't know, like, five Plie Tendu du Releve shirts in my closet at all times. It's my favorite shirt because I designed it myself and I wear it like seriously every day and so it's embarrassing to be like, oh I made this and then there's just like six of them sitting in my shirt. This shirt my friend Stella made for me last year when Christina um, was on So You Think You Can Dance and we all wore them and this was like before she was famous and there's only five of them in the whole world and it says Christina Perry rocks and we all wore them the night that she performed on So You Think You Can Dance so that's pretty cool. I wear it sometimes. I used to wear it more. So I have like an entire collection of vintage um, Van Halen t-shirts and it's because my swoon works for that band and so he'll like always bring me home like vintage Van Halen t-shirts so there's like this one I love and this one you guys see me wear like every day and they're all made by Chaser and I love them so much and um, so I have to be honest I like only know one Van Halen song <laughs> It's Jump, <laughs> and it's kind of embarrassing that almost every day of my life I'm wearing a Van Halen t-shirt. <laughs> oh well. Oh, this shirt! Okay, I will never get over my Cats t-shirt because Cats was the very first musical I ever saw. My mom, actually my crazy Aunt Vera took me when I was eight, but my mom was there. And I remember watching Cats and falling madly in love with Mr. Mistopheles and being like, why am I not in Cats? Like, I have to be there. They're wearing unitards, they're kittens, they're singing and there's dancing involved. And since that, when I first saw Cats, that's when I wanted to be a dancer. Oh, this is my lucky shirt. I know, it's super ugly. I swear to God, if I go to an audition and I get all cute and I wear like a sparkly bra and little outfit, I never book it. But whenever I put this shirt on, I always book the job. It's so ugly. I don't know why that happens, but it's like my lucky shirt. I can never get rid of it. My old vintage Rolling Stones t-shirt. Ah, ah. 1981, it's the original concert shirt. One of my exes got this shirt at like a store and it was like $400. And then when we broke up, I totally stole it. Because it was my favorite shirt. And I wear it all the time to this day. Sometimes I see him and I'm wearing the shirt and then like we both know like, you stole that shirt. And I'm like, I stole that shirt, but nobody ever says anything. Yes, mommy. I love my visor so much in the sun in the summer. I love my visor. It's my favorite. I love it. This is her little scarf when she wants to be in the hood. Do you love it, Hobo? <laughs> Thank you, BuzzNet, for coming and seeing my closet, and now I'm going to take a nap. <laughs>